Holy f Woo! That's what I'm talking about. 100 grand, great deal for a truck. I'm Jim Carson from Blackstock Ford Lincoln, Orangeville, Ontario. I've been doing this for close to 40 years. Not as long as that 1948 Ford's been around, the first F-Series, 75 years, but long enough to know what I'm talking about. I have driven hundreds and hundreds of high-performance vehicles. I love driving my F-150 Lightning for no other reason. I don't care about the stance on the environment. It doesn't matter to me. I'm driving it because it is fast as hell. But is it as fast as the new 700 horsepower Ford Performance Parts Limited Edition F-150? You be the judge. Riley Murphy's gonna show us all about it. All right, so maybe my 40 years of experience doesn't impress you much. Maybe I'm too old to know about the new technology. That's why I got Riley Murphy here to join me. Come on in, Riley. You know, Riley is uh, one of our sales guys here. Riley's a drag racer, uh, drag racing his Mustang. His pit bike is a modified Coleman cooler with very high output electric motors in it. So makes them pretty cool in my book. But I'm gonna have Riley tell you about what's so special about this Ford Performance Package F-150 and why 100K is a hell of a deal. So Riley, let's talk about what we've done here. For sure, so before we talk about the kit, we have to talk about what we started with. So this is a 2023 F-150 Lariat with the 502A high package on it. Obviously you have to start with a five liter if you're gonna do a supercharger kit. Uh, and it's got the black appearance package on top of that. So what that gets you is this unique hood, uh, unique interior and some accents, as well as the dual rear exhaust that exits the bumper. You'll see uh, the difference between that and a standard F-150. Um, the kit is from Ford Performance FP700. Gets you a few different things. Starting at the back, you're going to get the lowering kit. So that lowers the rear to closer to level with the front. You're gonna get the, the wheels as well. Uh, we've got a decal on here, Ford Performance badge on the fender. And then up front, you've got a Whipple three liter supercharger. That's gonna give you 700 horsepower and 590 foot pounds of torque. Now let's go back to the vehicle. Fine and dandy, Lariat, Bang & Olsen Unleashed sound system, power moonroof, great vehicle. To me, the most important standard feature of this F-150, or not standard feature, optional feature, is the gear ratio. What is it, Riley, and why? It'll be 373 electronic locking. We've got 305s on all four corners. I assure you, this dead hooks from a dig. All right. Now, the the special features of the, the uh, blackout package. Now, if you took this truck without the blackout package, what's the, what are the options for the exhaust system? So, Standard is going to be a single exit exhaust. Without the blackout package, you can still get a dual exhaust, but it's gonna be below the bumper instead of set into the bumper like this one is. Yeah, and and I, would, I would just add my two cents with MBRP we've been selling for a long time, and it's a very high quality product. Yes. MBRP puts out a great product, and this carbon fiber shell with the larger diameter tips looks fantastic with that cutout bumper. And sounds incredible. Why does Ford not think that the cutout bumper for dual exhaust should be standard? I don't know. Yeah. Uh, maybe they haven't figured out people like dual exhaust. Took them long enough to figure out people like black accents, but it's here we go. We have it. So, okay, so you can put it on anything really with a five liter V8, of yes. course. Preferably to have the 373 axle, in our opinion. Yep. Uh, and you really could make this truck, this truck could be easily under 90,000. If Easily, you put it on, yes. an, on an XLT or something yep. like that. Uh, the, what about the options of the wheels? Did they come as part of the package? The wheels are part of the package. You can do it as well without the wheels though. Okay, and those are 22 inch? Yes, these are 22s. So for example, this has got a little bit of a lowering kit in the back, gives you this street look. This truck looks fantastic. That might not be for everybody, but in my head, Hey, if you didn't go with the optional 22 inch wheels, and if you wanted more of an off-road look, like our FX6 behind us here, six inch lift, maybe not quite that high, you could do that. But the money that you would save on not getting the 22 inch wheels, a good place to invest that money 
would probably be the Ford Performance level kit with the Eibach shocks and the, yeah. or the Eibach springs and the uh, Fox 2.0 shocks, right? Yeah, especially with this power, you want the good yeah. springs and shocks. Yeah, and then you could upgrade to say a 33 inch all terrain tire. You could get the look and, and, and that you're going for. So very flexible package and around the same price. Yeah. Again, on a loaded Lariat, give or take a couple of options, you could easily do a Lariat with the sport appearance package and blackout package for a hundred grand with the Ford Performance package included in it. Where else are you going to get 700 horsepower, brand new, fully warrantied for 100K? In a truck, I don't think you're going to. Can you do it in a car? We haven't done a video yet on our 24 Mustang. That's yeah, interesting. We, we can't yeah. talk about that yet. Now, while the Lightning doesn't have 700 horsepower, how much torque does it have? It's It makes a ton. It's And, and it's instant, right? Yeah. Uh, and it's super fast, but by God, the sound, the whine of the Whipple supercharger and the exhaust. Okay, Internet Keyboard Warriors, you're right. You can't replace that sound. That's a thrill. It makes it feel like you're going two seconds faster. Yeah. Yeah, very much so. All right. Next on, on the actual package itself, uh, from Ford that is, the other key part I like about the blackout package are these blacked out headlights. Yes. It just cost you way too much to try and do that afterward, yeah. right? Why not do that package? There's a little bit of duplication we should tell the customers. A little bit. Because yes. you're already getting black fender vents, right? Yep. But these black fender vents are gloss black and they say Ford Performance. Yep. Nice touch. The black letters on the back, all right, they're 60, 70 bucks anyway. But they're already there as part, so you're duplicating that. But if you were to try and buy that bumper, buy that hood and buy those that headlights. Yep. Seven, eight thousand dollars maybe? Yep. You'd probably be adding up there by the time yeah. you painted the hood and the bumper and everything. The grill so. actually, I don't think I touched on the grill oh, is right. also part of the Ford Performance package. Right. I didn't think of it because the black appearance truck does come with a similar grill. This one is a little bit different, but it is similar. So bottom line is you don't have to go with the blackout package. You could do this on an XLT without a blackout package. Hell you could do it without a sport package, but the reason that we like this truck, uh, the Lariat Black Sport Package, Blackout Package, that is, in combination with the Ford Performance Package, is those critical pieces, headlights, hood, and bumper. But, hey, you can just go single entry. You know, if you don't, th if you think 100 grand is a lot, and it's not, Chrysler Raptor R, priced, Chrysler Ram TRX, uh, priced out Anything else in that high performance uh, truck, like a Shelby F-150 at a 183 Canadian? Ooh, that 100 grand is starting to look cheap, but it could actually be less than 90. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. What about the uh, the Stripe from Ford Performance? I like it. Yeah, I think it, wor it works really well, especially with the Avalanche truck that we picked. Yeah. Uh, although I don't think it would look bad on any of the colors. No, no, we, uh, this truck was originally shown to me uh, almost a year ago in a, in a prototype configuration in uh, in uh, the bright blue color. What's it called, Riley? Velocity blue? Yeah, Velocity. Or Atlas? Uh, they're both, one of the two. They're yeah, similar. they're both pretty similar. And with a painted to match hard tunnel cover and a body kit on it, which is not actually available, but that truck looked really sharp in that color. But you're right, the Avalanche with black accents and that black and gray stripe, it's killing it, man. Yeah. It really is. So yeah, so you got a truck with leather, you got heated and cooled seats, of course you got power seats both sides, uh, you got automatic temperature control, you got all the great features, the big screen and sync 4, all the great features that you get in a 502A Lariat, and then the package, the Ford Performance package, as an entire kit, 25 grand installed on top of that truck. That's a lot, but you're getting the, the 3.0 supercharger, 700 horsepower, warranty approved. You're getting uh, the fender badges, the striping, the 22 inch wheels, the lowering kit, um, and the front grille. So you're getting quite a value and that, that price is what we're charging. We have looked at it, we've cut the corners on that pricing and we've made that pricing very attractive. We think you're gonna have a hard time finding a better deal than that package. Yeah, try to do that in the aftermarket no. for all those parts. No, and then you don't have the warranty. It's true. Yeah, so uh, let's get to it. You've driven both. I've driven both. Yep. My Lightning's the demo. Fastest truck I ever drove. <sighs> Define fast, Riley, tell us. Yeah, I think the Lightning probably, would, in the 60 foot for sure, 
the Lightning's got it beat a little bit. Just with electric motors, you've got a little bit more precise control of traction. Um, yeah. From you know 80 kilometers an hour punching it, I got to give it to the FP700. All right. Well, let's uh, let's try and give uh, the viewers here a little taste of what the Lightning sounds like when we rev it up. Just kidding. Let's give them a little taste of the supercharged F150 with the MBRP exhaust. Uh, one of my favorite exhaust companies. No drone. It's not obnoxious soup can rice rocket kid. Uh, it is tasteful, but it gives you that low bass that you want without that drone in resonance. And when you're in it, eh, yeah. I gotta say, yeah, hard to replace that. So let's check it out. Let's fire it up. Sounds good. All right. So there we have it. The question is, do you think a hundred grand is a great deal for this truck? You just can't deliver this kind of luxury, performance, utility for a hundred grand in Ontario or in Canada here, avoid the luxury tax. It's a fantastic deal. It really is, right? About the same price as the Lightning. Pretty much, yeah. yeah. Take a Lightning Lariat, yep. same equipment, add the extended range battery. Yep. You know, you're going you're to be right in a, there. you're going to be right there around that price because don't forget uh, for the audience, this truck is treated just like every other F-150 Lariat, meaning from the incentive standpoint. So we can use the six thousand dollars currently available that bring that price down. Yep. We can use the three point nine percent financing that's currently available and finance all of these automotive accessories all in one package from Ford Credit. What a beautiful thing. So I think. Uh, I think you're right. I think uh, I think this is my new favorite truck. Yeah. Look at that. I go from the lightning all electric to the old school burning gas, <laughs> 700 horsepower F-150. Well, I want to thank you for watching. I want to thank Riley for joining us. Any of our sales guys here are quite knowledgeable on all of our aftermarket products and Ford Performance products. You can get a hold of them. Schedule a test drive. Uh, we're not uh, we're not hard to deal with. You can do it all online through Skip the Showroom if you prefer. But hey, you don't want to skip the test drive on this. Come and see us at Highway 9 in Orangeville. BlackstockFord.com is our website. BadDogMods.com is our off-site modification shop. Once again, this is Riley Murphy from Blackstock Ford, and I am Jim Carson. We both want to thank you for watching. Holy. F Holy! That was just a little bit of break and it just dug. <laughs> Woo! That's what I'm talking about. Holy shit! Awesome. <laughs> wow! Wow! All right. Is it faster than the Lightning? It's more fun. It is. I'm not sure it's faster initially. I, it is. I think it is. Yeah. I don't know. I think it is. We got to get on a track. Yeah. No, we got to line these up and find out. We just got to keep these away from anybody buying them to get there. Yeah. <laughs>